All right, let's do that talk about the work boots. Start with a pair of shoes. I still kick these. These are the Walmart specials. Uh, I don't know, 30 bucks, 40 bucks, something like that. Um, they got the blue on it. They match my work outfit. I don't wear them too often. Um, you got inch and a half where your feet get wet anyone working on roofs know that even when it's not rainy you get puddles like that these are Ariats. these are my fancy shoes that I currently are still rocking um, they do have replacement soles in them can see Dr. Scholl's. Oh, they're on their second pair of soles. These are my daily beaters. They are the Wolverines. Um, I just put a new pair of soles in these guys last week. Um, so there's the three go to's. If I'm doing something fancy, I'll wear them. If not, them. Well, these are my Claude Hopper, my Carhartts. Um, I've used them up pretty well. Uh, they still are on their original soles. Um, still got a little life left in them. Again, you only have two inches to hit water, and you're going to have wet feet. You can tell these. These were my babies. Look at that bad boy. Ooh, she is worn. Worn, worn, worn. El Toro Locos. They were and still are one of my favorite boots that I've worn. These are the higher tops. You can see uh, next to the other ones that they are, I believe, the 10 or 11 inch. And, uh, yeah, they've seen better days. I no longer wear them, but I keep them there to remember how much I like them, and that will probably be my next boot purchase. Um, I did replace them with the El Toro Locos over here, which are even nicer than my Ariats. Um, they still got the OGs. And they really, they really haven't been broke in all that good yet. So, I haven't worn them too often. You can see they barely got any anywhere. Um, them are my next new fancy ones if I got a meeting and need to show up with some pretty shoes. That's, that's soon to be the replacements. These are... The old clod hoppers from Walmart. Um, one day I got wet feet and wet boots and went in and that's what I got. You can see the wear on them things down there. They, uh, they got some wear. Uh, they're comfortable. And then I got the Ariats here. These ones I believe are blown out too. See it back down in here. It is blown out. I've tried to uh, fix them up with some Amazon products, but haven't had the heart to throw them away yet. Uh, nice boots, but can't wear them no more. So they're they're going to be retired. Or one of these days, if I find me a shoe guy to fix them up. I may just get them fixed up. What 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 are your guys' go tos? What do you what do you prefer? You prefer high tops, low tops, tennis shoes, flip flops. Um, I work just okay this year to be able to wear tennis shoes, no steel toes for work. Um, I've I've always every one of these got a safety toe of some sort in them whether it be steel, composite. Um, 
I've always kind of had a self requirement of steel toed. Um, I like the high top just because not only support but a little bit of protection from critters. Um, the boot talk guys. What's your go to? My go to's if I have to recommend something is do you have wide feet? First question. The answer is yes, El Toro Locos. Uh, I like square toes. I don't know if you've noticed. Square toes, baby. Square toes. Square toes. Um, I will say that uh, uh, El Toro has got Ariat beat. Um, they're, the the Ariats are a little tight um, for wide feet. If you get the square toes, uh, the El Toro Locos, they, they break up and they're pretty wide. Um, I would say that's my two go-tos and these are my new go-tos. These took forever to break in though. Forever, forever to get comfy. I've had these for quite some years now. So I believe these are about five years old. I got these back in Michigan. Um, I got them back in Michigan. And I got them back in Michigan. Everything else has been since I've been to Florida. So let me know. Let me know what pair of boots I should be looking at. What are you guys rocking? What what what's the, the go to for you guys?